Good afternoon, LB. Mark Kowalski, your superintendent here on Friday, April 17th, day 25 of our online learning program. A very January-like day uh, here on Friday, April 17th, as you can see by my attire today. have several announcements today. First of all, concerning our food service program, beginning on Monday, April 20th, we will be changing the time of our evening food distribution. Uh, it will now occur between 5.30 and 6.30. It used to be 6.30 to 7.30, and um, we are changing that now on Monday. So it will be from 5.30 to 6.30 p.m. Uh, Monday through Friday. The next um, item today concerns our food decorating contest, and we have winners to announce today, several winners to announce today. First of all, our kindergarten winner is Logan Hamilton. Our first grade winner, Cameron Shadbolt. Our second grade winner, Sawyer Amstutz. Third grade winner, Dexter Stripe. Fourth grade winner, Addison DeCumin. Fifth grade winner, Cohen Levenhagen. 6th grade winner, Aiden Levenhagen. 7th grade, Alyssa King. 8th grade, Brianne Thrall. ninth grade, Karis Willow. 10th grade, Caitlin Grouse. 11th grade, Taylor Best and 12th grade Kylie Evans. Our classified staff winner Jason Kitchen. Two other staff winners Jenny Welty and Stacy Pickett and our administration winner Brenda Frankert. Thanks to all who participated in the food decorating contest. You can find those on our website. All the pictures of the winners and participants under the daily video updates. So thanks again to all who participated. Also on Monday, and this is also, you can find this under our daily video updates, uh, there will be a smile parade. Um, the details of the smile parade will be under our daily video updates. Um, it, it basically is a drive-by uh, of the Heritage Nursing Home and the Fox Run Manor Nursing Home. Um, to, uh, to provide some support for those patients and those residents in those nursing homes uh, at that time. So, please look at our daily video update if you're interested in participating in the Smile Parade. Um, the next announcement, basically if you haven't had a chance yet to read my letter um, from yesterday, I distributed through our all-call system, please look on the website. Um, and um, it addresses our online learning and what we're going through currently and, and basically how that's going to make us better in the future. And that's uh, what we're focused on right now. We're going to make lemonade out of lemons, so to speak. And everyone's doing an amazing job in these tough times. And I appreciate it. Um, just one other thing. I hope everyone um, somehow, some shape or fashion got 1% better today. I want to wish everyone a great weekend. The weather's going to get better. It's got to get better sooner or later. Um, we miss you guys. We want everybody back in these buildings. But obviously we will work um, and we will operate under the governor's orders. Uh, hopefully we'll see everybody May 4th. Um, but everyone have a great weekend. Um, see you back here on Monday. And as always, go Eagles. Have a great weekend, everybody.